The way to get rid of tension is to do just the opposite of all the things that cause it. Vaughn Painting, and today we have a towel showcase with Anshi, the Toe Ether Reel. I hope I pronounced this uh, correctly. Uh, I don't want toe players, uh, towel players, to come and, and you know and snap my neck off because I didn't do that right. I'm not, it's my first towel ever, so uh, this is Anshi, I think, Chao Shi, Chao Meng, something like that, and. Um, so basically what I tried to do with this model, uh, the client wanted to it to be close to the GW scheme and on the GW page you don't have pictures of the back. So for the back cloak I went with colors uh, Beastie Brown, uh, Snake Bite Leather and some um, white for the eyelights and bleach bone. I also used a little bit of sapia in there. Uh, for the base I went for a kind of like not deserty rocky, but also a rock that would be in the same kind of, uh, of herdy tone as the model to complement it with uh, the snow base. Because I thought that if I did the rock in gray, it would have been you know too much of a contrast from the, the, the guy that it's in the brown tones and then the white and the gray. I, I thought it would not match really well, so I went more with a uh, herdy kind of feeling on the rock. Did the did the snow using. Tamiya uh, Diorama Texture Paint Powder Snow Effect. We have some water effect down there with a little pool and uh, some icicles. And this is the guy. The skin was made with uh, glacial blue. And also it was uh, uh, a lot of glazing with uh, the, the glacial blue mixed in with midnight blue. But I think it's pretty nice. I added some tattoos so it has a full sleeve which is all red and an armband that is um, that is red on the left side and an armband on his leg. A little bit of free hand on that. There's some designs in his tattoo. Uh, so, you know, I'm pretty happy with it. I, I think it's a pretty cool model. Let's try to, uh, to just focus on the base. The base is pretty cool looking too. Um, I, I really enjoyed making this base. And I'll be having probably a tutorial on how how to make bases that looks like that. So how to do the snow effect on the base using the tire, uh, the diorama texture paint. How to uh, to do that little lake on the base. It only works with 40 millimeter. This model normally is on a 20 millimeter, a 25 mil uh, base. But you know, I told the client about another base that I made for Drago that also had a little lake or pound pound pound. Oh fuck. A little lake whatever uh, there and um, the client was like yeah I like that that's pretty cool you know can you do it I was like I'm 25 millimeter we can't really do it so he said yeah go for 40 no problem so you know gives me a little bit more space to work in but basically that's it you know as you can see the super frosty base it looks pretty cool uh, this model is pretty cool too. I, I, you know, it was easy to paint, but at the same time, it was still challenging with the skin and everything. His facial features are really nice, but I don't know the video probably doesn't do it justice. But there's going to be a picture at the end of the video. So thanks for watching. If you like this video, subscribe. A lot of tutorial coming. Uh, Golden Demon model uh, project that I'm going to be doing a little talk on, on my project. It's going to come out soon. As soon as I know that it's safe to show my conversion, because I don't want nobody stealing my ideas. And uh, basically that's it, so have a good day. I'll see you on the next video. Cheers for watching.